Welcome to JVR Industries. Today I'm gonna to go over dry vacuum pumps versus oil lubricated vacuum pumps. I'm gonna give you three reasons why you would wanna consider an oil lubricated rotary vane vacuum pump chamber vacuum sealer. And that would be something like our JVR Vac series. So stay tuned. <laughs> Welcome back guys. So the first reason why you might want to consider an oil lubricated vacuum pump versus a dry pump is air removal. Now there's quite a difference actually in air removal. On a dry vacuum pump like this small little unit over here, it's going to pull around 90% of the oxygen out of a package. So you're not getting, you know, all the air out of the package. You're only getting roughly 90%. Whereas our JVR VAC series units like the VAC 100 or the VAC 110 behind me are pulling a minimum of 99%. So a 9% difference from like the average of this machine and the minimum of that machine. Pretty incredible. So you're looking at nine plus uh, percent difference on these an oil pump versus a dry vacuum pump. And obviously the oil pump is taking the win on this first reason as far as air removal. The second reason why you might wanna consider an oil lubricated vacuum pump is it's much quieter. So I'm gonna go over the volume difference between this dry vacuum pump versus a oil lubricated vacuum pump in the VAC 100. The volume in this to this is a 20 decibel difference. That's significant. So I'm gonna quickly run the two units so you can hear a side-by-side -side comparison on these two units. And that 20 decibel was using a phone application, so it's not like a calibrated decibel meter, but it will give us a roundabout idea on volume as well as showing you on this video. So. Let me just quickly run a cycle on this one. And while this is running through a cycle, I run the cycle on this unit so that you can hear it straight through the speakers on your computer. Quite quiet actually. And here's this one. Much louder. So we're on to reason number three now. So the last reason can be quite deceitful when you're reading up on dry vacuum pumps. When you're talking units at this price and you're comparing apples to apples, well, I guess apples to oranges, right? Uh, oil lubricated pump at, you know, in this machine at $900 versus like a five to $800 range dry vacuum pump machine, uh, chamber vacuum sealer. When you're comparing those two, you might see that some of these cheaper units will say maintenance free. And when you read that, it sounds great. So we're comparing maintenance free versus a maintenance pump. What is the big difference on those two things? Well, the maintenance free is not as good as it actually sounds. So if you plan on doing products without any moisture in them, this won't be a problem for you, right? So if you're only doing like, you know, dry beans, dry rice, anything dry, that dry pump is right up your alley. But for those of you who are looking at packaging steaks like tomahawks or briskets or chicken or salmon, anything with moisture in it, soups and so forth, then you'll likely having this issue. So the issue is once moisture gets into the dry pump, there's no maintenance that can be done to it really. So you just, it's done once it's done. Once that moisture gets in there, it's gonna start corroding the pump internally and there's not much you can do for it. Now the nice thing about oil lubricated vacuum pumps, they are maintenance pumps, right? They require maintenance, but that equates to a longer lifespan. And the reason for that is because when moisture gets inside that pump, it mixes in with oil. And when you get the pump up to a certain temperature, it's able to separate the oil in the water and expel it out the exhaust of the oil lubricated vacuum pump. So, Yes, it might sound good getting a maintenance free pump and it might be perfect for you if you only plan on doing dry items, but if you plan on doing items with moisture content, you might want to consider getting an oil lubricated pump so you're not spending hundreds of dollars on a pump that's just going to go 
into the garbage. Once again, guys, thank you so much for checking out JVR Industries on YouTube. I hope all this information has been extremely helpful. If you guys have any further questions, you are always welcome to call JVR Industries. Uh, we believe we have unmatched customer service and we're really proud of it. Um, if you call us, you'll likely get your answer same day, um, very likely. Um, problems with your machines, whatever it might be. Um, and even if you have other chamber vacuum sealers and you have issues, uh, we might be able to help you out. Um, we typically don't offer that kind of help, but if you need it, you're in a desperate situation, we might be willing to spare a couple minutes of our time to help you out with yours. So um, once again, thank you so much for checking out JVR Industries. Feel free to subscribe, hit the bell so you can be notified on future videos. And we'll talk to you guys soon. You guys have a great one.